Hi, I'm Atif Khan, VP Solution Architecture at Viptela. Today I'll introduce you to application aware traffic steering in Viptela's SD WAN solution. Let's start with an example. We'll start with two sites. Let's say site one, which has a V edge, which is Viptela's WAN edge router. It's connected to a transport, which could be, let's say, MPLS. You have another site which is also connected to the same transport. There is a V-edge sitting there connected to this transport as well. Now there is uh, application traffic between these two sites. We will take an example of uh, a couple of applications. Let us say there is uh, voice traffic between these two sites. And uh, everything is, let's say, working just fine. You have voice which uh, goes between these two sites. It takes the MPLS transport, gets to the other side. You may need to introduce certain other applications which may require you to increase the bandwidth on your transport. Bandwidth on MPLS is not cheap. So you may decide to introduce another transport. Let's say you bring in a different transport, which is broadband internet. You introduce another application. Let's say in this case, you have some enterprise video application. Now you need to make sure that the video application traffic goes between sites over the broadband transport. So video traffic in site 1 comes to this V edge, takes the transport which is connected to broadband and then similarly it goes to site 2. This is all done by applying a policy at the central controller, which is the vSmart. You apply a central policy on vSmart, you make sure that certain traffic, which in case, in this case is video, is steered onto the transport, which is broadband internet, between these two sites. You also have to make sure that certain other applications uh, or data from certain other applications, in this case which is voice, stays on the transport which say meets a certain SLA requirement which is required for this application. In this case this is voice, so let's say voice application required a certain SLA from the transport and that is latency of less than say 40 milliseconds, drop less than 1% on the given underlay or the transport. So you have a central policy which is sitting on the, which is applied on the controller. Controller makes sure that traffic, or in this case the voice traffic stays on the transport which meets the given SLA at a given time. It could be MPLS in most cases, or it could be at some other uh, uh, time, could be the other transport. So whichever meets the SLA, it routes or steers that application traffic onto that transport. And now in this uh, scenario, both transports are terminating on the single V edge. These transport, uh, transport connections can be terminating on different V edges in the same site as well. So irrespective of where the transport terminates, in Viptela solution, we can still achieve application aware traffic steering, regardless whether the transport or both transports are on the same VH or there is one VH per transport. In summary, with application aware routing, you can steer traffic based on the SLA requirements of the application. How we do it in Viptela solution 
is by maintaining real-time characteristics of loss, latency, and jitter of each path, and then applying policies on the centralized controller, such that critical traffic is always steered onto the most reliable link. In case of failures, the high priority traffic is handled correctly. Last but not least, this architecture can scale to thousands of nodes in a full mesh topology. Thank you.